Hi guys, welcome to another video of The Random Burrito where we talk about books, food, gaming, pop culture, and everything else. So if you're new here, uh, don't forget to subscribe and click na lang po ang notification bell so you know you get notified every time we upload something new. And uh, today's video, we're going to try out uh, Domingue's Ngoyong and coffee from Cafeteria, courtesy of Norman. Um, Ngoyong was courtesy of Ed Domings and Let's Eat Bye. So I won um, their contest. Or mag post lang pictures sa imuhang food nga na order uh, through LEB. So let's go ahead and uh, try it out. And while we are eating the ngoyong and drinking the coffee, we're just going to talk about um, the recent development uh, within the LEB community. So I'm sure um, most of you, if not all, uh, kabaluna sa sa issue. So, LEB admin is under fire. Some developments along rules. So they're going to charge sellers 1,000 pesos every month, and that's per seller per category. Correct me if I'm wrong. So meaning, if if I'm a seller and mamaligya ko og, for example, um, desserts, and then mamaligya sa ko og crispy pata, that's that are those are two different uh, categories so if magpost ko tag sa tag sa um, that's 1000 each and that's uh, per month if i need to kind of boost my post by uh, posting another one that's an additional 500 so uh, they can agree act so someone most likely members of the shop i did uh, reach out to him so i asked if um, seller siya and you know, i just want to know where he's coming from kasi siyang nag post first I think sa like outside LEB so gi screenshot ni ang post sa founder regarding the registration the mandatory registration fee and so gi piastaan gi sa mga tao before the move to charge sellers kay the LEB members um, the numbers were at about 105,000 um, I checked just a few minutes ago kay down na siya to 101 Dagan gapong kayo, but you know, um, like sayang nga na inana siya because I really like the platform. I really like how the admin um, managed the, the page. Nindut gicha pagkadala. Yeah, I'm not a seller. I'm not affected by the by the move, but I don't think it's quite fair. I think dahura kayo ang amount. Um, and what I'm afraid of is. Ipasa sa seller ang um, extra costs sa uh, buyers, so you know there is that. So as a, as a buyer, I I don't find it um, justified. So dako agad siya kayo, and I'm hoping he reconsider sa admin ang ilahang decision about about the fee. Um, I did talk to one of the admins. <clears throat> Again, I'm not going to drop names, but if you want receipt, I have receipts <laughs> at the ready. So I message ko na lang ko so what you know unsa unsa maning ko an um issue about LEB and the fees. So ang yang reply was um they're going to look into it and see if um like ma na changes because uh, at the end of the day um it's still a uh, community and they're they're going to listen sa uh, feedback. But you know my two cents regarding this is Dapat nag asa sila sa sellers or sa merchants. Like, what do you think, guys? We, we will need some funds because kasabot ko daghan good og trabaho ang admin. Because again, it's a well managed page and it could not have been uh, managed very well if kulang sa tao. So, but probably dili 1,000 a month. I mean, probably 1,000 registration, like one time registration, good for a year. And then every month, charge sila og 100 to 200. I think that's still a lot of money. Like again, over a thousand members. Butang nato. Five percent lang anang sellers. That's still a lot. And you know, wala may buy ng Facebook. Um, kana lang. So I think it was nasayup sila og compute. I'd like to think. I don't want to say na they they got greedy and they got uh, carried away. Sa ilaha one thousand member, one hundred thousand members, because. Kana ang backlash kay it's not worth. So karon dagan kig ng gawas na mga spin off na mga groups. I have I have a list. So there's uh, Ngaon Tadol, Cebu Food Community, 
Cebu Market Market, mga unta Cebu, Lan Lan Party, We Market, Buy Let's Eat Some, Ka Unta Buy, Food World Cebu, Cebu Food Guide. Uh, there is a parody group na interestingly ng daghan yang yang uh, members. It's a uh, Let's Eat Ba. So gikuan ng ugai. So Let's Eat Ba. Uh, Chino Moves Deliveries and Services. And then, um, according to James Nico Vlogs, magtukod si Chagia. Ang tawag is Fangta Girl. <laughs> so, iyan ang idea. So, I don't know if dagag mo join. <laughs> Comment below if mo join mo if magtukod siya Fangta Girl nga page. I'm really hoping na ma iron out nila ang, ang problem. At the end of the day, you know, delete manato pwede i like limtan ang. Gibuhat nga maayo sa, sa, sa admin. So, kana lang. I hope it becomes a lesson to them nga dili magpataka og make og decision na dagan ang um, maapektuhan. So, um, sa katong mga groups nga kung gi mention, um, I, I think I joined because some people invited me. There's nothing wrong exploring other um, other groups. But I will stay with Let's Eat By. I don't have like anything against them except sa kato lang na concern like you know i i'm one with everyone na against sa katong amount ng ilang ginapangayo um uh, i'm thankful because you know again i won i won these um via their contest so kwani siya ka book guys 300 pieces of ngoyong na nadaogan ako so 7 pesos each uh from domings so Dako dako sa chang nakuan. And I cannot eat everything. So, um, majority ani kigi panghatag na nako sa silingan. Like, I reach out to some of my friends na nainabal an na mark donation drive, but karon daw nga time mark uh, nahuman na or something. So, you know, ano mulayo pa ko namang kuya mga silingan dia nga. Pili ma share ani. So, let's go ahead and. Tikan kiko gitabi, but, um, dapat food review siya. So, this is their sauce na. Na try na nako niya. Um, it's very spicy. Like sili gud ang yahang kon smell. So they gave me three of these. So dapat siya pa ego siya 100 pieces per 500 ml. So let's try one. So it's kon it's of decent size, but Look at the filling. Gamay siya, but na agud siya unud, which I really appreciate. What I hate about gagmay ng nga ngoyong is kanang masubrahan ganin kadagan ng yang coating, like din hin. So I don't like that. Like ganan ko makatilao sa ubud. So let's try. Pagato din lang kay freshly cooked gudya, init init pa. It's really good. One of the best ngoyongs I've ever tasted. I mean, the sauce is very halang though. So if wika or artika, the sauce may not be for you. So, katong first, um, or I'm not sure if Shang first nga nag expose na not really expose kay na balaan naman sa tanan ang ang move sa LEB nga mag charge no but kalong person nga nag nag post outside LEB I reach out to him and ngotana ko seller siya so dili daw siya seller but he feels for the sellers because dagan siya friends nga nawad ag trabaho because of COVID and dito na nangita og um, pangwarta so you know he feels strongly about this move to, to charge the sellers. So I, I understand. I was just very curious, my good why he was so strongly opposed to the point na, you know, he post ni ginato. So I really hope ma, ma fix funny, but there's just one thing that I not really wondered because I have an idea, na man. We've already produced like what? Two videos, not by upcoming three videos uh, involving food reviews 
featuring foods purchased via LEB. So, I requested na ma-post siya dito because aside from, of course, um, let's be real, nice good job clout because 100,000 members, like, diba? And we are a very, very small um, channel. Um, so, clout is good. At the same time, ganansag ko ma maghatagog like honest reviews of food so you know maka hatagog idea sa potential buyers and maka help sa sellers food to boost their products but um, the admins will not approve the post because they changed the marketing rules though and I guess that's the change that they were referring to they um, declined every um, attempt I made and when ngunra silang nadikdaw mo ag mo mo comply sa rules and then I, I I messaged one of the admins na in charge and the department um, that I'm not a seller, I'm not selling, but this is this is our money uh, among goal, money among tomong sa video. But they just said na someone else will review it. But it's been weeks, but wala kaya pong reply until ni about nga nga recent development. So I guess mo na siyang reason because you know. I'm not a seller and uh, dapat seller lang ang makapost, I guess. That's really sad. <laughs> but we will continue to support um, sellers po na nangita o kwarta karon ng panahon. So we will continue to order food. We will also check out other sellers uh, sa mga bagong groups and see if um, they are as well managed as the ones on LEB. One thing I noticed sa kaning mga new groups and of course that's very understandable less good job of engagement. So nindot good ang LEB on top. So to the founder and the admins I really hope you'll consider Grabe kaya mga hate comments. Like, some, sometimes maka una-una ka, that's too much rapod. Like, <laughs> too much rapod. Um, I really understand why the admins need to find a source of income. Okay, sila pod siguro mismo, basing wala sa trabaho because of COVID. Um, Subo Mercado is closed. So, understandable na mangita sila o pangwarta, but I guess na subrahan ng o price. The best way out of this, I guess, is just come out clean, um, apologize perhaps, na, na subrahan, na, na overestimate, and then, I don't know, just say sorry, even if you feel like you've not done anything wrong. I think, you know, Cebuanos are very forgiving. So, one of my friends who happened to be a seller at so LEB. Okay, nag message sa one of the um, admins nag asha about you know um, kung magbayad na daw siya og 1000 tanan ba post niya ma approve so ang tubag daw kay yes of course and then yung ipamuta nang na, so nag contradict siya sa imo ang giingon na you need the money because you need more manpower to filter the posts the point is gisin siya sa admin and then gi block siya sa facebook but that was a it's kind of a dick move, I guess. Kana lang, I don't know. Because I'm used to LEB admins being very polite, very courteous. Um, maayos la story actually. Maayos sa communication skills, maayos sa customer service. So, kana nga part, um, uh, medyo off, off siya. At the end of the day, um, customer mangya po na sila. So, I don't know, a little respect. I also noticed that some admins sa LEB ang ilang profile pic before kay logo sa LEB like atong red na logo atong bago now feel free to check it uh you na nila i don't know if gisugo sila nga mag-change or they felt like uh, dapat mo distansya sa lagamay because you know to avoid the hate coming from everyone online actually i didn't notice it uh, myself someone told me Someone messaged me. I also spoke to at least 
three sellers and they said sila obviously it's not gonna hand but they need LEB so ilan lang gibayaran gud ang ang 1000 kapin but sakit silang bukot na <laughs> so i'm hoping ma refund sila in case ma ma retract ang kana na policy Let's try the coffee from the cafeteria. Wala ni siya gipalit via LAB. But Norman had these delivered. Uh. Okay, so let's try this. It's quite strong. But lanit siya. It's creamy. Medyo aslum lang siya gamay because it's um, strong on coffee. It's nice. So, ang 1,000 per month, guys, kay one post lang per category ang allowed. Um, if kailang ka magpost ug additional, that's an additional 500. But nado yung only, ana, only edit option. So, pwede ni mo usab-usabo na yung caption for free. So, medyo paspas ang growth sa LEB, especially um, pag COVID. Okay, when they started in 2017, medyo gamay gamay Their motto is share what's on your plate and help the local food industry. I shared what's on my plate, pero wala siya approve, so I don't know. <laughs> I want answers. <laughs> and some people mentioned that they delete na daw ang post sa admin about the fee. But before they deleted it, um, Get turn off sa nila ang comments. Some people commented na they dug their own grave. Um, Nao kwarta daw ang founder. Lupig daw si Mark Zuckerberg kalibre ang Facebook but LEB fedile. Some mentioned sa comment na sigi daw dawat ug libre from sellers. I don't know if it's true. Someone mentioned um, na ikog si Mark Zuckerberg nagihimong platform iyang Facebook. Para manggata si Toot sa mga ginagmang negosyo. Okay, so, the ganay kung nakaon sa ngoyong. Um, I think I'm gonna stop now. Okay. Um, halang na gaja. But nami gaja. Um, again, one of the best ngoyong I've ever tasted. I'll post a description, I mean, a link uh, to the seller's page on the description box below. I think that's it for me guys. Thank you so much for tuning in. And if you haven't uh, subscribed to the Random Burrito channel, please do. And, you know, show some support. Thank you so much and continue eating. Ciao!